tune right here coming through for you from Lato, Mariah Carey, DJ Khaled. It's called Big Energy the Remix, and it's on Kiss FM, Kenya's number one hit music station. My name is Cheeton Glover, and a happy, happy for Rahi Day to you. Today, I've got one of the greatest and most promising artists from here in the 254. We've been sampling his brand new track right here with Chido and Seed. It's the one, the only, Brida LW. Yo, 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 the big baba, the big baba. <laughs> <laughs> in the building dude you're actually tall very tall like i saw you and i was like what this dude is actually tall very tall very tall now unajua kama unaingia kwa gym si juu for him asubuhi unajua tu unajua tu at lakeside of course you know i lived in lakeside for a while huh? mm-hmm. i lived in kisumu city kisumu city so i lived in uh, mamboleo mm-hmm. and then i lived in polyview and mm-hmm. at one point i lived in mambole in uh, not mamboleo milimani mm-hmm. and it was a beautiful experience and kisumu guys go hard in the gym yeah. What 6 a.m. Wako uko ndani ndani. Ona changamuka. But sasa let us see if your lifting weights in the gym can match up to our will. So I've got a will here that I'm spinning for you. Let's go letters from A to Z. Whichever letter the will lands on, Brida, you have eight seconds to give me a boy's name, girl's name, country color, and a celebrity whose name starts with that letter. But not to worry, I'll prompt you to end a haraka haraka though. Your yeah. letter is K for kick, boy's name, girl's name, Kevin, country, color, celebrity, Kenya. girl's name. Kendall. Country, girl's name, celebrity, color, girl's name, Kendall, celebrity, Kenya. color, and your eight <laughs> seconds are up. You've done well, bro. Yeah. And you've got a three. I mean, you got Kenya, you got mm-hmm. Kevin, you got Kendall mm-hmm. as a celebrity. The chick's name is one you didn't get, and the color is one you didn't get. But Nisawa too. This is one of me to join the chick's colors. name that starts with K. Yeah. There are a couple. You even said Kendall. You just still said Kendall as your artist, Ken- ah. a celebrity Kendall as your girl. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I mean, this year, like, you've been really active, Peter. Yeah. Like, this year, I feel like in this one year, you've had a couple of collabs. Mm-hmm. In this one year, you've also had about three or four singles of yours in this year, if I'm not mistaken. Mm-hmm, like three. So what has that journey, what, what made you, especially in 2022, come out that strong? Uh, basically, for the past two years, we've been, um, like, 2020 and 2021, most, yeah. of, most, of, most of it, we've been indoors. Yeah. We, we we're not doing gigs no joa to yeah. so once 2022 came yeah ni likuwa tu ni time yeah big baba and <laughs> ku, ku show the world what what i'm about yeah yeah and we're still going going on strong yeah yeah the and, future is bright and when you look at uh in terms of the fans response in kenya right now mm-hmm. to Brida Brida's music mm-hmm. how do you feel it's been the good and the bad man tell me both of them um it's only been good yeah the good is the growth yeah uh, from the consumer's perspective of just supporting and uh pulling uh p- pulling up to the gigs yeah uh just the the numbers on the social media yeah. uh, uh sites and streaming streaming apps the numbers have been going up so it's just a positive yeah uh, no negatives yeah really and when we get back i'm gonna be putting you te- to test to know whether you know your lyrics very well yeah so we're gonna be finding out in our game finish the lyrics but right now here is bn in inauma fam kenya's number one hit music station my name is cheaton glovo a happy happy for rahi day to you and on this friday i have one of kenya's most promising artists and i dare say the future of the kenyan music one Bida lw yeah 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 how did you guys end up in this collaboration by the way which one the ndovu niku trio mio pata uh i i had the tune yeah and uh at that time uh, i think i had linked up with ndovu niku yeah and he just dropped his 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 hit song the smash it yeah really cool. uh we vibed and after that when i i was making the record i yeah. i remembered ah, we talked about a song and i, I felt like it going to fit vibe yeah also trio trio is my boy yeah at yona ilikuwa too raisi after ndovu had voiced his part yeah uh nika trio pia nilifeel trio atakuna vibe ataleta yeah it was basically the three of us we have different vibes yes yeah that's what that's what happened yeah and I, I mean i like that the fact that you guys are doing collaborations but right now let us collaborate with your brain <laughs> and see if you can finish the lyrics so it's yeah. very simple i'll play for you a tune mm-hmm. um where it ends finish those lyrics i'll start you off local <laughs> Nameless, 
transaction will ogopa tumekuja kuhakikisha kwamba speakers inasikika hey you mr are you a member hey you sister wacha kulenga can't you see that i'm talking to you sasa we come kono ju ah perfect do you feel like isa was a big Okay personally I yeah. feel when Isa passed away mm-hmm. it was like one of those moments where Kenyan music was beginning to move yeah because I mean I, I think at the time when Isa was he, was doing like a lot of hits I was living in Zambia at the time okay. and we were bumping up to Bumba train in Zambia mm-hmm. and then Isa passes on and mm-hmm. there's just like the Kenyan music just goes pfft. do you mm-hmm. feel like there's a huge void that was left with Isa's untimely passing uh, not really Isa Isa is a legend for yeah. for what she did but you know when it comes to music and industries like you can't really say one person controlled the whole yes. thing you understand yeah even after that uh, ogopa still went on yeah there were guys like in uh kina nameless yes who kept on dropping hits from from ogopa those clips yeah, those, those are those yeah like it, it was a huge loss for the for the industry yeah yeah but uh the guys who are around badoli and elea to nearly yeah. graffiti do you think if had he if he was still alive mm-hmm. do you think the kenyan music industry would be in a different space especially region wise like east africa mm, i don't know about <laughs> nakuliza swali ngumu sana i don't know let's go to the next tune yeah Reader, there is no way you don't know this song, but I don't know that one. This is what I was looking for. <laughs> See, simple as that. This Which is tune? this is like a hit tune from Diamond. It's one it's of his hit Diamond. tunes. Yes, yeah, it's Diamond. <laughs> there was like a time every time you were in the club, they would play this song. Hey, mm-hmm. everyone would go wild. Okay. Let's put you up into another Kenyan old school tune. Yeah. <laughs> I'll give you that one. So those are two. Though you, you the apple only fumble, kidogo. You fumble just kidogo. Okay, this is the other one. This one for sure, you know. <laughs> of course i knew that one you would know yeah, yeah yeah and of course let's do up you in this one nipe tu masa kadha masa kadha masa kadha na wewe nipe tu masa kadha masa kadha masa kadha na wewe that is bida lw's brand new tune which is going to be blazing up in the next 1 minute 10 seconds and then we can get back play kiss marry or kill and you tell us about your brand new song one hit music station i am cheat and love when happy for rahi day to you and of course i'm hanging out with the can i call you an author of the <laughs> song <laughs> one breeder lw oh, yeah 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 chief yeah, i mean figure by eight is very clear mm-hmm. i think you you got inspired by uh <laughs> mapema and your best <laughs> mapema and your best. best and so i mean we get i i understand from i have my interpretation of your song mm-hmm. which we sh- we've shared on this show this entire week mm-hmm. but what was breeder lw's interpretation of figure by eight well my own interpretation is pretty much clear um and self explanatory uh-huh. just be on time kama nimesema tunakuja hii masaa fika hiyo masaa just be on time yeah. by 8 jamine shanga by 7 yeah kifika by 8 by 9 yeah yeah because i mean that's the canairo lifestyle konza yeah. friday mm. friday today i nobody Fridays. has time to be out till midnight i said friday usi kuna sato <laughs> <laughs> so i was asking you off air 
about how i mean i've we shared on the show here one of the vibes i got from your song was uh um ever blazing ever blazing girl mm -hmm. that got dun, 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 dun. there was okay. that one mm -hmm. i also got a bit of a fabulous vibe there i also got a bit of we ain't uh -huh. going i got that vibe as well on your song with seed uh -huh. but then I in a distance mm -hmm. I can hear Kero Ro. <laughs> I can hear like I can hear it in a distance. Yeah. Was that part of your ins uh, inspiration? Were those did we get your inspiration right first of all? No. I I <laughs> No. So what was your cuz I I can feel it. It's there in the song. No, 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 no. The the uh the producer of the beat is called Metro. Yes. Metro Misukadoba. Shout out to Metro. Yeah. Uh i don't know i don't know maybe maybe maybe, or maybe if we talk to metro metro's beat maybe will have metro will tell us because there are some things that are just too similar like you can't let it go it's like yeah. it's right there yeah, it's you in feel your... it you hear it yes yeah you interact with it all those tunes you've mentioned yeah not on my mind when i was <laughs> yeah so did the beat come before the lyrics or did the lyrics the beat, the beat came came before ah so then we, we should be talking to metro maybe even you actually you don't even know <laughs> <laughs> maybe metro knows where his inspiration had come from probably the year 2023 is literally yeah what eight weeks away from us mm -hmm. what do we this is a cliche question but mm -hmm. what do we expect to see from breeder lw in 2023 uh, bigger things mm -hmm. just uh growth uh we just we're trying to look at how the, the the international market looks yeah and trying to break those barriers and just get there yeah yeah so hopefully yeah Mungwa Kikubali. Yeah. Yeah. Brida is going to be an international artist. Yeah. In 2023. And is Shala. Brida dating? Does Brida have children? Does Brida. What is Brida's relationship status and family status? Uh, Brida is a poly polygamous. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Of course, you're from the leg side. What do uh, we expect? Just the leg side. <laughs> Brida is a polygamous man. Uh huh. Yeah. Not taken, but polygamous. <laughs> do you have children, Brida? Uh, huh. if you are thinking about it if you have the time to say uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> that's what i say you know? <laughs> <laughs> the big bubble yeah 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 the big baba the big baba so yeah lazima wako mahali mahali yeah i mean wakila mahali kila kona in kenya <laughs> anyway, Samuel Odiambo is coming through to let you know what is trending on Kiss. One of the most important.